hello guys welcome back in this video I'm going to show you the gym management system in PHP and MySQLi inside this system have many features I'm going to show you the each feature step by step so this is the admin panel of gym management system inside there have a total earning monthly invoice and many other things on there you can use many many features on there so here is the super admin and this is your dashboard this is the admin panel right this is the admin panel complete admin panel so I'm going to show you step by step the each features that are available on this system so first I'm going to select the customers and inside there I have a one customer you can use the action like um, delete the uh, customer and view attendance of this customer and show profile right and you can also add the customer using uh, this add uh, button so I'm gonna uh, let's avoid uh, the add John Doe and I'm gonna use uh, something like this one this one this one this one right and I'm going to use apc at gmail.com and this is my number dummy number right and I'm, I'm living in United Kingdom right and assign the height for example 5 point uh, six inch and my weight is around uh, 55 kg right I think kg right so I'm gonna set that okay we need to select the agenda and I think everything is a clear so let's save the right so this is a second one user has been uh, appeared on my screen you can also import the customers right and there's other uh, this is a pagination so for that let's check it now the attendance uh, page so I'm gonna click on attendance mark attendance inside they have a one member checked in right and this is a date you can also write uh, the anything else and click to search to find the users which are exist or not inside GM management system or inside your gym right so let's uh, move on the inquiry message you can send the particular user message using compose and select the user which user you want to I mean which user you select to send the email or send the message right so have a inside the drop down menu have a two members you can select anyone and assign the write the text and send to the message then user will receive the message on the admin panel this is a basically admin panel and also in this system have a user uh, system means user will able to see personal uh, details and receive the messages and many other things but this is a admin panel uh, dashboard so let's check it now the third one I mean uh, targets tab what is uh, inside there I have a no target you can add the target and subscription revenue you can select uh, the details date and and you can use that so I'm going to check this uh, subscriptions uh, the user has been uh, uh, paid one thousand dollar not remaining dollars and the starting date and payment complete you can use the actions like edit remove add payment anything else you can do that so I think I check out the client like John Doe and this is a main membership cost is I also use one thousand uh, amount paid 1000 discount not so this is a complete debt I use uh, 38 save and you will able to see 
the subscription page why do only one user but uh, I think uh, just a minute I check the price at new uh, I think the second vertical does not appear on here membership cost 1000 and amount paid 1000 and I'm gonna save that and leave the other options okay I think I need to use that right so I think we need to select the client so for that so this is my problem members uh, please select your member right so I'm gonna select the membership I think it should be display right so yes John Doe and I'm gonna uh, click to add payment use the payment method which payment method you want to use on there to pay at the amount right so this is the uh, feature of this application now the next one is the memberships the membership is 1000 you can uh, edit the membership like uh, uh, 2000 then user will able to see 2000 membership to join the what gem right so this is a task you can write the task title description and status and many other things you can use that so this is the account section inside the account section have a payments so inside there I have a one payment cash and many other things on there but I'll leave that and I'm gonna show you another things due payment no card okay right so payment reminder history no card okay and this is a complete uh, basically payment section and this is the invoice you can uh, create an invoice so I'm gonna create an invoice like uh, um, client name is what John I think we will able to see John and select the date like uh, this one client email abc at gmail.com I'll leave the uh, UK and I do not understand the I just click to what item I need to sign on there mm, but I think we need to add the items right so I use demo let's I check it now it's working or not I think we need to add the items and then you will able to see the details on there so I think we need to check that and other things so this is the expenses page and you can add the item on there right and purchase form and price you can use this one on there right so so I think we need to use that for example I use demo from 500 and this date uh, the price is 600 I uh, save and I think we need to uh, check it now using invoice so add the invoice create invoice so far so I call demo okay I can't see the item on there add item demo item quantity is one rate is uh, 500 right so this is a manually you can uh, use that so I'm gonna use John uh, select the date like 23 email abc at gmail.com mobile number something something and UK uh, let's check it now it's save and done we are we are seeing the sample uh, invoice on there right you can download that you can send the email with the particular user 
So I'm gonna click again invoice page and say there have a second one invoice on there, right? As you can see. So uh, let's uh, check out now the uh, reports. I'm gonna select not selected. What uh, we will make the trick, okay. fitness I'm gonna use John yeah best I select the second client reports and uh, we will see the I think we need to uh, we will able to see the uh, latest client but I can't see why not client appeared on there so I'm gonna use 30 days why I can't see my recently okay let's check it now the financial report so uh, payment received nothing I'm gonna select 30 days nothing right due payment nothing right so there are many other options on there you can use them and also another important thing on there this is the branches for example you have uh, many branches you can use this one features on there you can use add branch branch name it is and assign the all details inside this six this section once you assign that then you will manage that on there I leave that but this time have a one um, branch on there as you can see for Biden. and here is a permission super admin and assign the role you can use that so this is very very simple a J management system you can download the source code under the video description I have a link you can use that to get the source code so I hope you are uh, like that if you want to get the more source codes uh, which are developed in PHP please tell me in the comment or uh, write the comment I will uh, make a regular best uh, video which are, are basically the PHP uh, source codes or PHP scripts so thank you very much for watching please subscribe my channel thank you have a nice day